don't know. I'm just tired of this killing it down there. They got my son. They shot my nephew yesterday. I just can't do it. We begin with this sad breaking news. A mother overcome with grief after learning her son was shot and killed. NBC 4's Beverly White is in South Los Angeles for us tonight, where, as you can see there, there was a massive police response. Beverly? That's right, Chuck. A lot of hard feelings persist in this community since the LAPD shot and killed Carnell Snell here just about two weeks ago. But tonight, gang members are being sought for shooting another local teenager. A black man shot to death tonight, his body shielded from view near 107th and Western. Streets quickly filled with crowds worried police were to blame. But the dead man's family says otherwise. The officer said that it was, he told your mom that it was not, they were not involved. I don't know. But all I'm saying, this was a gang shooting. Unrelated felony stops nearby raised tensions even more and prompted a large police response. Most here say gangs killed this man and sent a second victim to the hospital. Brothers, y'all got to stop killing each other. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. They killing us. We killing us. When is all this going to end? Family insists the victim was not a gang member, but a 19-year-old father rearing a 2-year-old son. His mother says violence is common and out of control. I don't know. I'm just tired of this killing it down there. They got my son. They shot my nephew yesterday. I just can't do it. Oh, I just... Please, not right now. The locals tell us increasing violence is forcing permanent changes in South L.A. It's got to get a hold on the community. If we don't, you know, it's just going to get worse. That's why a lot of people are trying to move up out of here, especially the older people trying to get up out of here. And it's, uh, it's just bad. LA Sheriff's Department is leading this investigation but releasing no details tonight about the suspect or a possible motive, nor have they spoken about this alleged ongoing shooting spree that is this community on edge. The family, meanwhile, has tentatively identified the victim as 19-year-old Artie Gervon. Reporting live in South LA, I'm Beverly White, NBC4 News.